going on everybody welcome back to episode three of hns also known as heels and shields uh, i was just cruising around leeway unlocking the rest of the waypoints because having them grayed out is a little bit a little bit of an irk so i've only got a couple left to go uh but i was going through the chasm and i started this world quest just here which as you know is the millennial of the mountains which is primo gems and stuff like that but there's also a, uh, a big chunk of artifacts, which I believe are four star artifacts and probably good for Noel. So we're going to punch this out. I just want to say thank you everybody for the support on the channel. Uh, loving it and I appreciate it lots. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And feel free to give me any build ideas or team ideas with future potentials on this account. So keep it in mind, heels and shields only. See how we go. But the next couple, of, I'm just going to punch out this quest and then we'll go from there. All right, so I know this looks very different to the chasm because, uh, hey, it is. Plus, I also said at the end of the last video that I would be doing Dragon Spine. Well, I got a bit ahead of myself. To finish that quest, I need to be uh, AR28, which we are not. I am still uh, locked to AR25 because I don't think my team's ready to go up a world rank. I don't want to struggle. I want it to be to smooth and crazy. Well, what? To be easy. Is what I want it to be. Uh, so basically, cue dragon spine montage. Alrighty, we are back at the tree. I have been running around doing some grinding out here. I had marked all of them on the map. There's a few that are, are locked behind like cryo monuments, a cryo monument, cryo monument. Even my main quest, I'm locked behind cryo monuments right now. So that's proving to be a bit of a pain. So figured we'll just offer what we have, which will give me five levels, which should give me a couple of wishes and, you know, some other juicy stuff. I'm just going to offer it all. Is there no skip button for this? Oh. I'll skip to the end. All right. That's that sorted. Not as far as I would have liked. I would I can get here comfortably, but I need a cryo character. So we're, we're kind of stalemated here. I mean, all we could do is is hope that... Because there's none on this banner, is there? No. Okay, so we've got three wishes here, and obviously we're building up quite nicely here. So we're just going to we're just gonna rip it. Four star would be lucky. I think I'm too early to hit four star pity. So... I mean, we can pray, I guess, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I still need like four more wishes for that. Yeah, so no luck there. So the next thing I'm going to do is, as you can see, I've got enough AXP to probably be AR 26, pushing towards 27, which is more rewards. So we're going to go raise our world level, which I might regret, but it is what it is. And then we'll go from there. Alrighty, it's it's that time I think. I think it's the Abyss grind, there's a lot of primos, AXP, it's part of my adventure guide logbook thing. So we'll knock out these two now. I'm just gonna show the end of each wave. I'm not gonna make you guys watch all of this. So I'm gonna make a make some things happen and get some characters that I cannot use.
well that didn't quite go as planned. Uh, turns out when dealing with anything hydro, I am having great difficulty. But you know, it, that, that, it is what it is. That's fine. I'm glad that counts as domain, that's always nice. Um, and then the big one. So I'm going to have to work on, I, I don't even know what I'm going to have to do to actually get better star chance in there, but I'm going to have to obviously work on my characters and that's what we're going to do. So we will figure out what's going to happen. Now. All right, guys, so as you would have seen, I definitely struggled to do the abyss. Well, I struggle to kill a lot of stuff in general. So I've decided uh, it's a new project time, as I discussed at the start of the video. It is Project Battle Queen Noel. So we're, we're going to nip through a few things. There's a couple of things that obviously I need to do, and that is first, but not least, is going to be weapon upgrade, which that's a given what it's going to be. Um, most people should already know this. Also, in crazy exciting news, uh, Zhongli's banner was announced today. And big news for this account, obviously the man himself, Zhongli, but we also have Sayu, Animo character, which I need, and a healer, and Noel, which means I can get cons for Noel and potentially C6, Noel, and Sayu. I would love to C6 them both, because I think as a Heals and Shield account, the characters that I get, I should get the constellations as best I can for them. We're going to do everything in our power possible to get primo gems obviously i still have 10 days left to do this i will get this sorted on my next couple of days off so that's in three days time but first things first let's not fall in the water and drown we are going to get her weapon crafted what's well, her weapon like i don't think there's going to be anything that's going to replace it for some time so uh, i will get this sorted and then we're going to level it up as far as we can. Uh, the domain for it is out today. So I'm going to hit that up real quick. And we will go from there. Alright, so all that grinding, all that leveling, Noelle's a beast, we leveled up her artifacts a little bit, I ran out of artifacts, so we're sitting at 1368 defense, she has 18.4, 18.5k HP, she's my carry squad, don't look at this, um, obviously I've not changed much on the other guys, I did however just do Bennett's event, I've gone through and done uh, all of it. I wish there was a claim all button. It would probably make this a heck of a lot quicker. I think I could spam the bottom. That would. I can tell you that the water swimming is a lot of fun. Um, the combat was not a lot of fun. I definitely need to get my hands on uh, units for reactions or just strong units in general. Like no, don't get me wrong, Noel is great, but. She's not designed to hit the hardest in the game. So, what do we got left? Yeah, the combat one definitely hurt a little bit, but, you know, we got there in the end. A lot of um, resources, which is nice. We are getting so many primos from this. This is ridiculous. Uh, done all the quests, so I guess we, we get Bennett at C1, which is amazing. I'm very happy with that. We'll go to the event shop and we'll just buy everything because that is what we can do oh you get a hundred primos just from the event shop that's crazy i mean i don't know if i'm going to use uh anything out here for a little while because i don't know what fontaine characters i'm going to be able to use i think navi is going to probably be the first one i believe that i'll be able to use like thinking about it but that is okay so we will be wrapping up this episode um it's shorter than my average episode length, but I can tell you right now, in terms of gameplay and time, I have put so much effort into this one. But that's because I love doing it for you guys, right? 
look at all those primos, man. Look at them all. I'm not, I know I could save for these, but I'm not going to because I don't think I've ever done that. But we are at 46 wishes. Hopefully by Tuesday I can get this to 50. And we will, fingers crossed, have some good luck with uh, Zhongli. But I'm going to work on Noelle's talents next. I'm going to work on getting all of these. I think I can go to plus six at the moment. But we'll see how we go. But thank you everybody for watching. I appreciate all the love and support. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you're enjoying this series and want to see more. Don't forget to comment down below if you want to see different builds on characters, if it's at all possible. And I hope you all have a good day, good evening, and or good night. See you next time.